Right, so now we toss it out to the backyard. It's Toys for Tots time. Hey, thanks you guys. We've got a heck of a group out here. A lot of them really cold, but they are happy to be here to support our Toys for Tots drive. And we want to start with Sergeant Campbell. You still need a lot of toys. There's an actual deficit this year. We're really needing people to step up. Tell us about what you're looking for and what donations you're looking to get. Yes, ma'am. Good morning. So yeah, we are a, a little behind on toys. Um, first, I do want to say thank you to the community because you guys have been outstanding in your efforts and getting these toys out here. But yes, we do find ourselves slightly behind. If possible, we would just like to get all kinds of toys in as soon as possible. Um, if we can get that in quickly, if we're looking, if you are looking for a specific set, then possibly teenagers, boys and girls. Uh, if we can get toys for teenagers, boys and girls, it would be very, uh, very appreciated. And cash donations, always helpful. If you don't know what to buy, nothing like a good old check, right? Absolutely. All so right. we do have uh, cash boxes and uh, you can drop them off at the tent. Um, and from there, you know, we'll take the money to local toy stores and, and spend it there buying toys and everything like that and then take those to the warehouse. So yes, cash and checks do work. Well, as you said, the community is always fantastic with the Toys for Tots drive, and we've got a lot of people here who have already done a great job this season supporting it. One of them, Isaac Anderson, who's part of the troop in Blaine. Isaac, tell us about what you guys did to support Toys for Tots. We um, did a toy drive, which collects toys at I um, at the school that we do it through, and. Um, collect toys. Well, you guys did a great job. We want to say hi to all the scouts from this troop in Blaine. You can see Cub Pack 522 doing a great job. We've also got a group over here from New Brighton, Pack 367. Tell us what you guys did, Eric. Yes, hi. Well, um, good morning. Uh, we have a group from 367 and 106, and we also have one of our Eagle Scouts from Troop 106 here. And uh, we did a toy drive and we collected 75 toys. That's fantastic. That's 75 kids getting to unwrap this year. And of course, we don't want to forget with Al Dental, you guys also stopped up. Tell yeah, us this, about your this efforts. Is our third year, it's been wonderful. Patients come by and we've put lots of publicity out so that they know Allison did a lot of that for us. And patients come by and bring toys for their dental appointments. Some of them come by and say, oh, I forgot, I'm gonna come back. Mm -hmm. And we've had two, 300 toys. I don't know, a whole bunch. We're getting more all the time. Uh, people are gonna cash donations. And it's a wonderful organization. The Marine Reserve does a great job and Care 11 helps. And it's wonderful that the community is doing this. It's not just us that collect, the whole community is donating. It's wonderful. It really is fun to see. You wanna be part of this. And as we said, we're really looking for toys this year. Of course, Care 11, a huge sponsor of Toys for Tots. And you can drop them off right here at our tent. We're on Highway 55 and General Mills Boulevard in Golden Valley. You won't miss the Christmas lights and our tent out front. And of course, we have all this information on our website at care11.com slash toys for tots. And again, we want to thank all the kids and all their troop leaders, all the adults, everybody that came out this morning. We really appreciate you being here and we appreciate you supporting Toys for Tots and the Care 11 drive happening this holiday season. <laughs>